respected teachers, parents, and my dear friends. Good evening. Today, I'd be sharing one of my favorite books I've ever read. Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban, and also the full Harry Potter books. Yes, this book is just too amazing for you to avoid if you love reading books. I just can't brag whole day about how good this book is and how good the plot twists and the theories in this books are. So I should not get into that first because I wouldn't be able to stop the video at the time limit. But let me tell you, once you read this book, you'll fall into the resorting world. I just freaking love the way J.K. Rowling created her own world just from imagination. The characters mentioned and described here feels like a real person standing in front of you when you're just reading it. And something really interesting about this book is that she even created the creators and many more histories of the world. Which is just too amazing. I have read a lot of science fiction and fantasy novels and books, but none of them gave me the reality the Potter books did. The real world, the normal world, is mentioned in the Harry Potter book, but maybe as a rare one? Because the wizarding world plays the main role in this book. In every book, by the way. <laughs> With Harry Potter, Hermione Granger, Ronald Weasley, Ruby is Hagrid, Professor Dumbledore, Sirius Black, Professor McGonagall, and many more as the main characters. The whole book literally gives a vintage vibe. With wizards and witches all around, with wands in their hand which can create magic just by a flick. Isn't it just too cool? Of course it is cool. People teleporting, moving pictures, biting books, candles, parchment, inks and quills. Owls flying around with letters tied to their legs are just completely normal here. Which is kind of like weird for the people, like for us, because no, we don't write letters nowadays, don't we? But it is. They're mobile phones and they're, and they're everything. Letters are just something I got inspired into by reading the Potter books. Let me tell you one thing. I'd even lent my soul to someone if I could read all these Potter series again for the first time. Because it's way too amazing and iconic. The journey of Harry Potter, the main character in the book, from the normal world to the wizarding world is the main storyline here. But there are incredibly amazing plot twists, which are just crazy. And let me all tell you one more thing. That just try reading the book and, getting a, and get a peek of the wizarding world because it's just gonna make you happy. I really hope you'll once in your life at least read the Harry Potter books or maybe even watch the films if you hate reading. But if you read this you'll know what I'm talking about. I really hope you'll read and love the book, by the way. Thank you and have a nice day.